Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last week, Microsoft made File Explorer tabs official in Windows 11 build 25136, which rolled out to the Dev Channel Insiders. Now, less than a week later, on the 13th of June, which was yesterday in my region, Microsoft has now made File Explorer tabs and navigation updates now available to the Beta Channel Insiders, and that was with update KB5014770, at the, and that now takes the um, beta channel build to 2261.160. Now, this also gives us a good indication that um, the File Explorer tabs and these new navigation updates are going to be rolling out with the Windows 11 version 22H2 feature update later on this year. And if we just take a more in-depth look at the screenshot that was provided in the release notes, um, just to uh, mention some of those highlights regarding the tabs. Now, I did post on this last week, but just to do a quick recap, um, just like your conventional web browsers, as an example, you will be able to click on the plus sign, which will open up a new tab in the File Explorer. Um, if you have um, a, a couple of tabs open, you'll also be able to drag and drop uh, the tabs into different locations in the tab strip. The folder right-click context menu, when you right-click on a folder, will also have an option which will let you open a folder in its own tab in the, um, the tab strip, which I think is a nice handy addition. And then just to look at those navigation updates uh, quickly, um, a refreshed layout, as Microsoft says in their release notes, um, will now give you easy access and be able to navigate to your different folders in the left-hand navigation pane. And that will also give you access to your pinned and frequently um, used folders. And also your OneDrive cloud profiles will also be added to the navigation pane, which will uh, reflect uh, your username and also your associated account um, with your OneDrive. And also the Windows folders, which are available by default in the navigation pane, will no longer be displayed under this PC um, as I did mention last week. And uh, just like the dev channel, uh, the tabs, uh, the tab support and the navigation pane updates are on a controlled rollout to beta channel insiders. So as Microsoft says, um, they are beginning to roll this feature out so it isn't available to all insiders uh, in the beta channel just yet. So just be aware of that if you are in the beta channel. And if the... Um, if tabs are enabled in the next release of the uh, uh, release preview channel, uh, in that uh, build, which will roll out in the next um, update to the release preview channel, um, this will also be a good indication that um, the tab support and the navigation updates will be rolling out in the final release later on this year in Windows 11 version 22H2, which will be the first and anniversary update for Windows 11, which um, is expected to roll out in October this year. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.